No matter how many times I do this shit, I'm never going to be ready for it. It's always a, a constant battle uphill to uh, have some modicum of quality. But that quality, it never comes. It just, uh, you know, you just got to make it acceptable for the goddamn sponsors. This episode is brought to you by Cheap Budget Coffee. That uh, comes up to about 1 euro per 250 grams. And it has also been brought to you by the sweet taste of Marlboro Gold. <laughs> Wait, I can finally pop out chat. Man, a chat overlay is not a good idea. How the fuck do I pop out this goddamn chat? Give me a sec. Yes, fantastic. Can actually, can actually, uh, yeah, can see your messages nice and clear. How long has the stream been going? The stream has just begun. Uh, my God. Uh, don't worry, it doesn't matter how many of us are in here. I technically have already satisfied the contract. They only asked for, uh, a lot of people once, and that's in the contract terms. So I'm all good. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> Where is the foot cam? <laughs> Wait, let me let me let me try a thing. Do we have do we have like animated animated toes? Animated toes. What about woman animated toes? Come on. Fuck is this shit? Deviant art is uh, is not helping me. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Would that work? Wait, let me put that in my memes. <laughs> All right, let me add an image. Come on, would this work? I'm not down for toes, honestly. What the fuck? Oh, damn, that works. Man. How many images can I put on this? <laughs> I think I should, uh... I think I should add some text to so people know that this is, uh, this is a Seth stream. ha. <laughs> Uh, give me that shit. Is that uppercase? Ah, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Let me come on. Fit fit to that fucking screen. Great. Now I want. Give me a gradient. Yeah. Yeah. Can I animate this shit? I think I can animate it. Give me a nice little filter. Give me a scroll. <laughs> yeah, I think that's... <laughs> yeah, I like it. Oh my lord. Yeah, that doesn't really work. Oh, I'd love to stream Everlasting Summer. But, uh... <laughs> but, uh... I, I've been I've been working around with uh, some game, and a couple of games that uh, might a lot of people might not remember. So I might show those off. <laughs> Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> How many? Wait, you can do an image slideshow. Oh, so does it does it take that from a file? Oh god, this can actually just pull shit up from my meme folder. This is probably like really terrible. Okay, randomized playback. Uh the fuck? <laughs> this is this is not working very well. Anyhow. <laughs> okay, no, this is this is terrible. Let me get rid of that shit. Let me put something better than that foot fag bullshit. 
I, I have I have so few images. Oh yeah, perfect. Wait, I wonder. Could you what if you flip it horizontal? Wait, what if you flip it vertical? Ah, yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. What's well, good? Uh. So tell me, how how's everybody been doing? I know you're not gonna get my feet because I could be identified for my feet. But, uh, <laughs> wait, do I, do I not have like a, a slow mode here? I do have a slow mode, but it does nothing. Yeah. Oh yeah. Wait, wait, let me, let me, let me tell you some stories. Uh, yesterday I had to, um, I had to head off to like my, my friend's, uh, place cause he can't come back to this country anymore. He tried, um. He tried to shill me into buying his uh, his rig, which I was uh, really happy not to do because uh, that'd be about two thousand bucks for some very questionable stuff. But uh, I've never committed I've never committed like a theft that is so interesting to me, um, because you know like m most objects when they go missing, people can ask questions about them. Um, yeah, yeah, it's actually Albino. So Albino couldn't come back to this country that he was in because he's um he's stuck back in Norway because of Arona and everything like that. Wait, I shouldn't have said his fucking name. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I stole my man's I stole my man's dildo. But uh um I I found the theft of a dildo very, very interesting because uh you can't you can't ask for it back and you can't say that it's stolen because um, at that point you'd have to uh, make the confession and the admission that yeah there was a dildo I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go into the specifics he, he, he can say oh yeah. yeah yeah it's like you know it's, this isn't for me it's, it's my dildo now <laughs> But the but the thing I really really like is uh, I got me a, a new uh, door ornament because I think it has a suction cup. Um, I, I'll 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 make sure I, I probably take a picture of this. Um, uh, there, there's another occupant in my house uh, who is not going to be very happy about this. Uh, my girl's not going to be happy that I stole Albino's nasty ass dildo, <laughs> but it's going to make a great ornament. Um, I'm gonna. I'm going to say, uh, in answer to the question that was in the comments, uh, is it, is it a bad dragon? Yeah, probably. Um, I, I guess you could just take a guess. Yeah, of course it's a bad dragon. It's a custom made one. It has a nasty ass flair. Uh, it's, uh, red and blue, which is probably the, the most awful color that you could get, but Hey, it's custom designed. I also stole one of his uh, shitty figurines that uh, people make whenever they sell out. Do you know that these uh, disgusting little figurines? Uh, probably made by a sweatshop workers somewhere out there. You can you can get um you can get like one of those um, PewDiePie figurines, um, just just to like put on display. I'm always amazed how that is not the fucking. Um, PewDiePie U2s. That would, that would look pretty good, actually. <laughs> ah. Ah. I, so what, what, else, what else have I done? Oh, yeah. If I'm a little bit slow, uh, there is an explanation for that. I'm on uh, quite a quite a bit of painkillers because uh, I've realized what the experience of growing up is. The process of growing up is you wake up one day and uh, you moved your neck uh, slightly too far to the left one day. You moved it a little too quick in a way that's not meant for uh, human necks to move. And then the next day you're just going to be racked with fucking pain. I think that is what the experience of becoming an old man feels like. 
It's just going to accelerate from there now on. <laughs> no, no, you're never, you're never, you're never going to get a, um, you're never going to get a fucking u of me. Um, I, I think anytime we will actually get merchandise, uh, I got some cool ass ideas. I told people like the ideas and it's also handmade. So it's like, um, when we do actually have merchandise, the whole point is just, um, uh, I'm going to put something in your house. Uh, to scare the shit out of your grandma. That's it. Oh yeah, of course I work out. <laughs> um, it, it, it's an, essentially, like I, I like the idea of uh, certain figurines. It'll come sooner or later, once I figure out how to actually use a 3D printer and actually make that of material that will actually stay together. But I like the idea of having... Um, a particular figurine, but then you can put a, a voice modulator in that thing, and you can have it programmed to actually just uh, make sounds at intervals. Because I really like the idea of grandma uh, walking up on some shit you bought from me, um, and that shit just whispers. That that would be very very nice. <laughs> How do you, <laughs> how do you sleep with being a fucking dildo burglar? I, uh, I sleep very soundly. <laughs> the fuck? Wait. Let me, let me turn these off a li at least. Thank you. Yes. Well, if your grandma is dead, don't worry. Everybody's gonna, everybody's gonna have something of relation soon enough oh, most of most of my older family's gone anyway i got i didn't get neck pain from stealing a dildo i got neck pain from fucking packing up uh my boy's rig because he wants to just pack it over to somewhere else <clears throat> what else has been happening if you want a hint of uh, what is actually uh happening next Wait, I wonder if I can actually just log in. Um, Endless Space 2 is the, the next project. I needed a lot of time to actually figure out all the other races. So it's going to be a, a nice uh, in-depth review. So not, not only uh, shit posting, but mainly that. Also, thank you for the diamond, brother. What is actually happening today? Wait, wait. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll actually do some game shit. Uh, I will probably do more Fahrenheit because, uh, I want more Tyler, but, uh, has anybody, uh, has anybody played an old ass game? I'm going to see if it can actually run. Oh man. Oh yeah. I played Endless Dungeon. <laughs> oh man. King's Bounty. I played that shit a bunch. It's kind of like budget heroes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like Endless Space 2. It just, Horatio looks better in that game. Yeah, um, okay, let's see if this works. Okay, no, it does not. Oh, it does now. I find a, a bunch of these old ass games through, um, very discreet and um nice uh sites where you can obtain this shit how the fuck okay uh does anybody know about uh cortex command whatsoever it is a weird ass game essentially the concept is you've got like a uh in a future warfare will be done by gamers and uh you're essentially just a brain in a box you got to protect your brain from the other brain uh but you could also manually uh, you can also manually take control of shit. So I'll show you some shit. Um, this is a very basic mission with um, nothing actually too serious. So I can actually show you that stuff. I can't adjust the sound inside the game, so I hope it's fine. Hi, right. welcome to the fucking game. So this is your brain. This is your brain. You gotta keep it alive or, uh, or you're fucked. Um, 
But now the first thing we have to do is uh, get somebody to actually fucking slay for us. Because there's two things you gotta do. You gotta keep your brain alive, and you also need money. Money uh, requires you to have a couple of slaves to actually be digging shit out. Where the hell is this? Okay, pulse digger. So you basically drop these guys down, and my boy gotta stay here nice and safe. This game, unfortunately, uh, it was never actually completed. So, uh... I followed up on its development and they kind of just abandoned it. It's practically freeware if you're interested. But, um... Essentially, you can just put people on autopilot and they'll do stuff in the background. Now, let me show you real shit. What is our objective right now? Uh, we got some zombies that are being uh, auto-printed by uh, another core that's uh, kind of going rogue. And uh, we don't like that. Now, first, I need a little bit of home defense. You can think of this game as like worms, but um, I guess on a crazier scale. Now, you see, I dropped this guy down using a dropship. If a dropship makes it back to, be to the sky, you get the refund. Um, what if I told you this thing can still be manually piloted? So, we can essentially use this as a little cooker for these zombies. And, um, I've actually already fucked up. So, this is actually meant to go a lot better. Now, uh, I've actually fried my guy. I have no idea how I managed to do that. But, you know. <laughs> yeah, 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 you can actually, like, load shit with anything here. You can actually have, like, fucking bombing runs. Hopefully this guy won't blow himself up in the meantime. Now, we're just gonna crash this in here. And yeah, I will actually play Bastard Bonds once I fix my copy. And this is a, an example of like how you can autopilot dudes. So essentially, you can get like a little artillery piece weapon here. And you can like manual fire that shit. Wait, I'm just wondering like what's the, what's the, um, the goofiest way I can try and finish this. So technically, technically you could actually like order a, a blank rocket that has nothing in it. I'm just wondering if I can take manual control of this. This is, um, yeah, it's not working very well. It is a, it is an amazingly fun game if you give it the time. Uh, it's also about like 50 megabytes, so you can definitely have the space for it. So, no, normally you'd have to come in here with a gun, but uh, we're not normal people, so we're gonna fucking cook all these incubators using this, and I don't know if I can actually get the angle right. I'm actually wondering. No, I'm not actually gonna be able to cook this on my own. And a wonderful thing is, when you've actually lost all your controls, you can pretty much scuttle this thing. Yeah, there's a fuck ton of mods for this game. I haven't actually got any of these mods loaded, unfortunately. And, uh... So... Okay, so, uh, what can also happen is everything is rather fragile. So you usually put stuff on autopilot, so they actually start digging through and getting you, um, some money. Like, you need this gold. So, you put these dudes on autopilot, this man will probably not do shit, but here, let us, let us try a thing. I'm not actually sure if this would work. I'm not even sure if these will uh, even be aggroed, but you know, it's worth trying. I also found it very entertaining that um, uh, dropping shit down is also a form of weaponry. So technically that can also be a little bit cheaper than the alternative. I think these crabs actually will do decent damage. Now... Your brain is also rather fragile. Uh... <laughs> and uh, usually shit can actually blow up off screen.
Now I'll show you how like you would probably do this if you're actually doing it properly. Da -da -da. So essentially you can uh, you can order a lot of things depending on your little tech tree. Uh, I've got it set to that I just have all the tech trees because uh, they have some nice stuff to be using. So you put these boys in. Put these boys in. Okay. And I'll try and show you like an actual setup that is fairly decent. So for example, we want to look over that perimeter. So we'll have uh, Gatling guns and we'll have a Gatling drone. Yep, okay, my Gatling gun is already in the worst position possible. But that's absolutely okay. Yeah, I'm actually gonna check if crap spam's gonna work. Uh, luckily, uh, crash test dummies, they can, um, they can stay alive quite well if you drop them from distances. Humans are not so good for that. <laughs> Wait. So we just need a, like a little perimeter here. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I think these zombies actually do damage to us if they get to us. So, these men, they don't really move very much. But that's fine, because we're gonna get people who do actually move. There's a lot of uh, little guns we can try. I'm gonna see if a missile launcher is actually gonna be okay. Of course, you can automate people. Um, you could also tell them like a pathway to follow, and they'll try and do their best to actually do that. Uh, but the AI uh, can be quite questionable sometimes, especially if you got a, a guy with like a missile launcher like this. Um, you don't wanna you don't wanna put this guy on autopilot because he's just gonna shoot your shit. He's a he is a this is a very fun weapon. And everything's got, like, normal physics. Yeah, this is a Cortex command if you're just tuning in. But wait. Oh, wait, you can actually change the mode? Give me unguided or guided? Oh, give me guided. I want to see what happens this time. Oh, right, right, that's just dumb fire. I got it. I got it. Now, obviously, we're gonna need, like, quite a few men to, uh, storm that place. Um, so I think crabs will be absolutely fine for that purpose. Let me actually check. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try dummy assault. Can I just order more? I, I hope I hope the crabs don't count as hostile to me, honestly. I have no idea if it was a fucking flash game, honestly. Ugh. Simple times. Anyhow. <laughs> Wait. You can also drop bombs manually from these guys. But I will, I will try a thingy. Gonna see how much we can do with a fucking timed explosive. Let's do dummy assault. Obviously, if your guys are very heavy, they can't move very much. I, I could stream. Are you kidding me? Oh, I never knew you could actually manually control these. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. These can form a squad. <laughs> okay, I never I never knew that you can have like crabs as your fucking squad leader. Wait. Please give me the next guy. Wait, let's form a squad. Let's let's just hunt for the brain. AI mode. Yeah, you can napalm the crabs. Wait, let me let me let me show you what you can do. So for example, like your craft can uh, bring shit in, but it can also uh, bring in like napalm and everything like that. So I can do napalm and I can also do a cluster uh, mine bombs here. Also if they, um, if they stack on top of each other that's not a good thing. 
Cortex Command, if you're just tuning in. <laughs> if I played Star Sector, I would not be talking whatsoever. I'm just going to be quietly building shit. Um, oh, wait, let me check. Let me show you some other stuff. <laughs> I, 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 found out, I found out one of the races. One of the races also gets uh, rocket-propelled chainsaws. Ah. Try our best. Yeah, let's go guide it. I, unfortunately, these zombies are very explosive. Uh, the AI is also quite intelligent. The AI is actually fairly intelligent. Uh, I'm not, because uh, the force of that explosion knocked off my gun. Uh, if you give them uh, alternative guns, they will immediately try using that. Come on. Get rid of that thing. Please? It's also, this game also has a sick-ass soundtrack if you listen to it. Just qu quickly. Qu quickly! It, this is a, it's also a lot more difficult to pilot than you'd think. And uh, your boys can also lose legs. They can lose arms, and they can keep on going. Right, let's do our best. God damn it. By the way, this is a tutorial mission practically. Please? Please? Yeah, okay. This ain't working. It's okay. Gotta try the chainsaw instead. So, okay, you see that dude? He, he's literally grabbed it. He's got the fucking <laughs> missile launcher. Wait, let's see. I don't think I have a vertical height here. See, that's a problem of going in with one dude. Let me actually check if I can do this nicely. Um, I'm just gonna come in with boys with AK-47s. Uh, you can also um, save presets. So you can deliver as much as you can, as long as you've got the resources for it. And of course, you can manually pilot them. Come on. And of course, if you if you shoot if you shoot the, the grenades in midair, they will explode. I'm actually wondering if I can uh, use this. You can pick up anything, and. Uh, what the hell? Oh yeah, okay, you actually throw it. Okay, we need more boys. We need more AK-47s coming in here. I'll say if you'll notice our economy is kind of running low, but hopefully that won't become too much of a problem. We're just gonna form a squad of everybody we have here. And let's fucking hunt. Come on. We got him. Come on. Oh yeah, and doing like high impact collisions to people, that will actually injure them. Oh god, he's carrying it. My man, my man's not gonna make it because he's bleeding out. That's a problem of getting humans, unfortunately. Come on. Form a squad. You can essentially just tell the AI to, you know, follow you around and go on autopilot. Come on. I think I was gonna detonate. Come on. This is a throwback to Stalker, honestly. Come on. Yep, he made it. 
I think for uh, poetic justice, we have to do it with a bomb as well. Okay, try. Do your best. You're gonna have a very happy retirement. Now oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, I think I have to eject this into space. Oh, what the fuck? I completely forgot about this. Fucking hell. God damn it. Oh, wait, 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 those are actually part of the AI. Come on, come on. Yeah, I don't think a sawed off is very good for this situation. Come on. Come on, man, you can do it. He doesn't have a leg, I don't think. Oh, he has one leg. He'll be fine. Okay. I don't think he's gonna do too well. Oh, I need to carry this goddamn chip outside. Um... He'll be fine. <laughs> this game is dedicated to the brave warriors of the Mujahideen. This, <laughs> this woman can thinks she can just go in here, preaching her Alawite bullshit. This is a sunny zone. Out of here. <laughs> Okay, gotta drop the AK, and... Wait, 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 okay. No thing, no thing, um, I'm actually not really good about it with this game. I did, I did find out about it, like, later on. Also, um... <laughs> okay. Okay, please. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm not very good at piloting ships. Give me a sec. <laughs> it, it's cause like, um, you can hold down the mouse button to, uh, take over some stuff, but if I take over, like, that ship at the exact wrong time, I'm just gonna fuck everything up. Okay, please. Please! Please, please, just, just stay. Just chill, just chill. Okay, okay. Now, now hopefully it won't actually blow up while I'm doing this. Pick up that- come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Uh, I'm gonna cook myself. I'm- I'm actually just gonna cook myself the longer I keep doing this. Please. Okay, okay. Uh. I, I need to, I need to honestly ask a question. I, I don't actually remember how I can load this shit onto a ship. I'm gonna I'm gonna try as ge as as gently as possible. As gently as possible. Cause like any slight movement you make. Um please. Do I just drop it? Uh, okay, do I load myself? I have another stupid question. How do I load myself? I have another stupid question. How do I open the cargo? No! Okay, fire to... Oh! Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, as you can tell, I'm not very good at this game. Ah. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> ah. Okay, um thank you. That is more than I knew about the game because it never explained that you could do that. I don't think I ever had that explained in the fucking tutorial. Uh there is a campaign mode. Uh, it's kind of gay. Uh not a, not and not in a good way. 
But uh, I'll show you an example of a scenario. Yes, okay. Uh, oh Jesus, this is a map I haven't seen. So here's an example of like a skirmish. So essentially you just gotta dig into your man's place and fuck him up. Rather simple in the end. Unfortunately, I don't like this map because we're way too far underground. Give me, give me the grassland bunkers. Um, uh, if you're ever interested in this game, you can actually play it uh, in uh, Hot Seat. So that's, uh, that's really, really goddamn fun. I highly recommend it. I think I try to play it once with somebody in Hot Seat. Now, how can we win? How do we win? It's a very interesting uh, method of victory. So I think... Oh, fuck's sake. That's not fair. Fucking come into my place. Go, 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 go. Okay, form that squad. Form that squad. Patrol mode, go. This is what happens when a man puts his fucking crabs next to me. Okay, this is not very efficient. Give me an anti-air drone. You're meant to put these on so they don't actually get tempted to drop shit down on top of you. Mm hmm. Wait, let's see. Now, I would like to try um, a tactic of just winning this game. I'm just gonna see if it's gonna work. Uh, it probably is not. Give me a sec. Come on. Oh my lord! Okay. Shit is actually getting worse. What, what is my brain doing? Where is my brain? <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, uh I, I think I think um this is a good time for a little reset quickly. No, you idiot! You idiot! This game may be too advanced for me. <laughs> uh. This is what happens, and then I go into the map that I don't want. <laughs> My brain left. Truly a fitting end for the brain left. I, I never thought I'd put him on, uh, on autopilot. I, I really was hoping that he just, um, he just sticks to his normal AI. Yeah, give me sentry mode. Alright, let me, let me just put some anti-air, uh, defenses here. Good god. I'm just gonna drop fucking crates on him. Sometimes the most effective weapons. <laughs> Wait, I wonder if I can just actually just bomb them. This is a beautiful thing about this game. Give me... Give me some normal drones, please. <clears throat> my my men's are uh, are not that competent, unfortunately.
gotta gotta try for the the most optimal thing. Let's save that preset. I think the crabs will be useful for many times. Please give me a break. Oh. I have um I have crashed the game. This is a cortex command. Uh, let me let me let me try that again. <laughs> the, the game the game truly fucking does not appreciate me not uh paying attention to it. Okay, let's see. Let's do brain versus brain. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I would just call it like worms with more RTS. Give me that shit. Give me sentry drones. Oh, please. Oh, please. Give me, give me so many anti-air drones, please. Wait, we can actually drop them from the sky highs. This is working great, honestly. I think it'll be fine. <laughs> okay, well at least we have um, anti-air drones and everything like that. I think it'll be fine. Beautiful. I forgot what kind of launcher this is. Okay. I wonder if we can just have some very, very cheap militias. So I have an idea. Where are my bodies? Give me... Give me men with battle rifles. This is not working out as well as I hoped. I am definitely going to play the Tyler game because it's actually a lot easier on me. Oh my lord. I truly know what it's what it's like now to be up against somebody with 105 IQ. <laughs> My man crying about parasocial relations, still hanging on D Live. Wait, I have an idea. I have an idea. I wonder if it actually works by drop crate. Oh no, it won't let me. Okay, so it's actually like the engine fucking up. It's not, it's not... <laughs> it's not my problem, supposedly. Uh, there's also like a lot of different missions. I can, um, I can, um, I can encourage you to try uh, this game out, honestly. The game is very hard, but I, um, I do think that you should still suffer through everything. Good god, is there any better weapons? Oh right, I have no money. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Now unfortunately... Unfortunately... Switching to your uh, digger is not a way that you actually survive. Wait, I'll just show you like what it's like to pilot one guy manually. Wait. Okay, we have a shoddy. Okay, we have a digger. And we're just gonna dig ourselves a fucking hole to hide in. I, I thought this game is freeware because like if they're not developing it, and I thought they like pretty much gave a source.
Oh my god, okay, wait. <laughs> this is a real footage of a Vietnamese trenches. Gotta, gotta fucking hide from the Guaylos. Please! I think I learned my lesson this time. Right. I will do... I will I will be able to uh, deal with the Guaylo at least once. Yeah, I, I, I know it's Chinese. I don't know what the Vietnamese term is for foreigner. So, uh, we're just gonna dig ourselves a fucking trench here. And maybe we'll just live here for the rest of the war. Please, God. Please, God! <laughs> Fuck it. If I'm not good as one man, I'll be worse as two men. No, no, no. The, the viewer decrease is meant to be happening that way. Because, uh, we already satisfied the requirements that DLive has. Besides, streaming is only nice when it's a special occasion. If you stream every goddamn day, uh, it's going to erode your fucking mind. Anyhow, let's go do some real tactics. I think that's a very fuel-efficient way to work. I'm on it, man. Don't worry. Some might call this inefficient. But I call it, uh... I call it the only way I know how to do things. Y you know, you know what else I found, like, very interesting? Okay, yeah, wait, fuck this dude. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. I don't even mind. Oh. Oh god, they also have a ship. No, I find this whole- I find this completely fine. Honestly, just stay on patrol mode. Okay, that's fine. We're all good for now. Now? Ah, oh, their base. Rather undefended, I'd say. Okay, wait. Mm. So all we need to bring in is somebody who could actually bomb that place. So maybe... That's a cluster grenade. I think a brown coat technology is pretty much a Russian tech tree. Wait, this is actually getting quite bad. This is not looking very good. But hopefully, we can essentially uh, hold out over here while my drop ships do all their damage. <laughs> what the fuck is that gun? He's fine. Ah, uh, my man is fine. Okay, my man is not so fine. Wait. One more time. And I, this is my last attempt, and then we're gonna move on to games where uh, you're not gonna see my incompetence so clearly. Okay, wait. Give me a sec. Oh wait, that's actually incredibly cheap. Sick. Oh, yeah. Yep, here they come. 
This should be easy enough. Yeah. Well, most of them. I do, I do agree, though, however, that uh, it is nicer to try and pilot the rocket to be aggressive. The rocket can't... Uh, the rocket is not as easy to control, unfortunately. Drop that shit! Okay, I crashed the game, unfortunately. I need to kill the fucking process. This game is uh, using a grand total of 200 megs. Give me a goddamn second. <laughs> it's 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 running for me on the on the processes now. It, it, it is a great game, though. Oh, one thing I wanted to show. Gives me an excuse to log into Steam. Oh, yeah, and uh, as an announcement, since I, I got to actually follow up on this, because I, uh, I said so last time. Uh, yeah, we're going to have, like, a lecture uh, for the final stream. I think that'll be nice. Um, it'll be very generalized. Uh, cancer immunology, but maybe it's a it's gonna be some new learnings. Who knows? Oh my lord <laughs> I, I'd love to get a Mandalore to come over, but our, our time zone differences are quite a big uh, big difference like in terms of my time I'd catch him at 10 p.m. And this is about five. Oh. oh boy. Wait, 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 wait. Let me try and maximize this shit. What the hell is going on here? Wait, give me a sec. Is this a scalable window? Oh, this is a scalable window. Yeah, boy. Um, apparently, um, uh, our, our game Domina, which we played last time on stream, that actually got updated. And what's really nice is, uh, we got new classes now. Um, I'm gonna see if I can give you an example. Let's purchase a slave. Uh, they added uh, a bunch of new classes, which are kind of cool. Uh, the Scissor is like a dual weld class. They've got a Sagittarius, which is uh, a bowman, who is uh, surprisingly very lethal for uh, gladiator combat. Like, he sucks on his own, but he can shred an entire uh, enemy formation. Um, yeah, 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 shout out to my boy Turianus, who's dead. <laughs> uh, Charioteer is meant to have uh, slight bonuses when he's actually piloting a chariot. And he's got a whip. Which is kind of nice. Uh, the Veliti is uh, the new spear class, who is a bit different from the Retarius, because he doesn't have a net. Uh, but he can have two spears. And apparently, yeah, it, it's true. Uh, the ancient Thracians, they, they actually traditionally fought with two spears. So it's, it's not too out of a question, because the Roman Empire would have had gladiators from Thrace. Oh, the treasure chest on the stream? Yeah, that's basically like communist redistribution. I'm just going to redistribute these now. <clears throat> uh, I'll, try, I'll try and show you like uh, how things are looking. Uh, another thing that's really, really fucking cool. Oh, my agent was caught stealing. He is dead. <laughs> Time to hire a new agent. Oh... Uh. The only thing that doesn't get an agent killed um, is uh, finding prostitutes. And any, any time he tries to do some shit for um, against the legate or the um, magistrate, he, he just has like a 1 in 5 chance of dying. So um, with that in mind, um, let's organize a pit fight. 
Oh, thank you for the Ninja Jishi. I have no idea what all of these uh, are valued at. I swear to God, if I actually lose this guy, I'll be very upset. Per Persianus? Persianus is my new uh, Turianus uh, 2.0. So I'm just trying to chase him up. <laughs> my man survived the pit fight oh by the way if you do you see that shit that comes on screen yeah this shit really spooked me out but apparently uh a, a lot of the backhand coding of this game like they just do it through a fucking command prompt so so don't be scared it's not valorant wait i have i have more slaves than men i'm just gonna get more uh archer boys Give him something to cover his nipples. Um, l legit, like you asked, like how do I find games? Cause, cause I had to answer this question of how do, how do I find good shit? How do I find a uh, good shit to play? And I never got it from any main game website. IGN, they won't provide that. Uh, GameSpot, okay, yeah, occasionally. PC Gamer, they're only gonna cover things which are triple A. Or at least single A, because, well, that's what the fuck they're paid to do. They have, like, a, a deal for that. Um, I, I literally find that through a Malaysian peer-to-peer -peer downloading network. Uh, which I can't uh, give the uh, identity of, or the link of, because it's rather secretive. But, uh, g genuinely, piracy and peer-to-peer -peer groups... That that stuff is where you find good shit. Oh, and um, okay, I can tell you like one thing uh, about this place: uh, the Malaysian peer-to-peer -peer, um, game trading shit. A at one point, they had like one uploader who was having a tussle with the Malaysian guy who was the admin, and and I think he got really mad at the Malaysian guy, and he was like, "Oh, I'm gonna dox you. Your information is gonna be out there on the internet." Uh, unless you comply with my request or some shit like that. The Malaysian guy just said, uh, nobody gives a fuck if they know where I live. Like, what are they going to do? Go to Malaysia? And he basically responded by, because the other guy was American, he responded by, like, releasing all of that guy's information. And he just said, like, I'm sorry, I didn't want to do this, but you fucking started it. <laughs> um, so, uh, there is there's even drama in fucking piracy circles. Oh man, all of these sounds. Uh, I can show you like one thing uh, they've changed now in the game. So you got Brutal, uh, which is I think the, the setting which makes fights go on for longer. They uh, now have Very Brutal, Impossibly Brutal, and Brutus Maximus. Um, I have never actually tested it with this. So I want to try with an exhibition match what is actually going to happen. Wait. I wonder I want to see if like my main boy can do well against these guys. It's also my famous move uh music. So we got to make this good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Forget, forget about me talking, just listen to music. Yeah, my boy Persianus, he's 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 doing a good damn job. Agreed. 
That is one fucking hell of a um, exhibition match. Wait, let me. <laughs> I'm gonna put it on to just impossibly brutal. Yeah, boy. You wouldn't steal a horse, would you? But I would uh, get some carnal entertainment for my man. Educator, teach me. Wait, you could have been teaching philosophy. Yep, carnal entertainment has been well received. I need my man to be happy. Because I need him to fight immediately. Oh, um, my, my favorite underrail build is, is literally going for full Psy. Uh, unfortunately, if you get to the end of a game, full Psy can be really annoying to deal with. Um, if, if you want to just go for the entire game and have a great time, you can just do Stealth Sniper. I, I want to actually see, like, because um, uh, now we have Charioteers. I actually want to check um, how good would they be for the Chariot races. Ooh. I hope my man doesn't die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I need to, I need to send some of these boys home. Honestly, I want to keep <laughs> put to death. I never understood the point of putting somebody to death. Yeah, did I just put two hold grounds on him? My lord. Wait. I want to check how the chariot races look now. Wait, we don't have a chariot, do we? Uh huh. on the. All right. I swear to God. If I can't per purchase um, a chariot right now, I'm going to be very upset. Yeah, granted this man is freedom as well. Everybody getting freed. Because all I really care about is making my man here as bulky as possible. Alright. Agent. It's time for you to. It's time for you to do good deeds. Yep. I. Right. I want to see what one of my men can do against everyone else, literally. Wait, wait. Give him like a little bit of assistance. Yeah, I think that's fine. <laughs> oh man, my man Priscianus can't deal with nine people at the same time. No, now he's annoyed, but he's almost there. My man's almost got like, oh, I think he's there actually. Um, I think based on his veterancy, he's actually gone to champion status now. Oof. Yeah, I need him alive. I need him alive for my championships.
Oh, um, I'd be interested in doing a Battle Brothers uh, a review because I heard a lot of good things about that. You know, it was a crazy thing because Big Nick is a dude who did the OST of this game. I had the impression he um, he also coded some shit here. Celius has appealed for release. Are men not created equal? Approve. Narcissus is appealed for release. Deny. <laughs> my wife is with my child. How do you have a wife? Wait. My man is just not fully healed. Uh, Distant Worlds Universe Review? Huh. I, I can put that on the list. I haven't heard about that one, actually. You know which one I do want to do? Um... Do, do you know? Do you know? Like, there's a, a scuffed ass game called uh, Two Worlds, Two Worlds, and Two Worlds Two. I unironically fucking love those games, and I will actually cover them at some point. Yes! Oh my lord! Oh, that is a good man. That is actually a good man. Okay. Can we actually change his name? Oh wow. Wait, wait, what kind of symbols can we actually put in here? Give me a sec. Can I can I just check this? Um Assy Swastika. Cause I'm just checking. Would this work? Ah <laughs> no, it wouldn't work. My goddamn assy doesn't work. Wait, wait, wait! Oh no no no, he's getting upset because I'm renaming him. Oh my lord, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I hope my man can actually do some good riding. Because uh, I'm going to be very disappointed if he can't. Right. Forest Chariot Rally, let's do this. Where are you, Van? Yep. Do your best, my man. Oh yeah, Pathfinder Kingmaker is gonna come. I fucking love that game. <laughs> Wait, what's going on here? Okay, that he's, he's actually doing very, very well. Uh, I, I know Library of Runa. I don't know if I'll actually cover it. Um, I will cover uh, Lobotomy Corporation. Might even show it on stream a little bit. But uh, Lobotomy Corporation is a, it's a fantastic game. But um, as, as an SCP game, that, that is a game that has like... It, it, it really entices you with false promises that you actually think that that game is casual in any way. I, I swear to God, you, you get to, um, I'd say about day 30 on Lobotomy Corporation, and then shit starts changing. Uh, this is uh, Domina, if you're interested. I think my man actually just took everybody out of a goddamn race. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can imagine it was uh, very profitable for the riders. Yeah, the other thing that they get wrong with uh, Ancient Rome as well was that um, gladiators die. That, that, that's, that's not a thing that would happen. Maybe as, a, as an accident. But, you know... It's not very sustainable to just keep losing men the whole time. 
Uh, traveling herbalist knocks on the door, offering spices and herbs that will for a... This man's gonna fuck me up, isn't he? Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Stone shard. That actually sounds very familiar. Wait, let me just get away from this swastika emoji. I think I have actually heard of this game. Oh, yeah, wait, wait, wait. You know which game I actually fucking like? Um, it's also, like, kind of a little bit scuffed, this one, Balram. And, you know, I like that game um, for all the wrong fucking reasons. If you walk around and just go through life in Balram, um, you get, like, a, an infestation in your backpack. No other game has had a situation where Oh, suddenly you hear some shit wriggling around in your inventory. You better click it fast to fucking crush the maggot that's eating all of your food. Yeah. Wait, one sec. I want to do one uh, pro gladiator fight, and then I think we can try um, Fahrenheit. Let me, let me check. Let me check. Ooh, I can actually bring friends. I wonder I wonder if it can actually synergize together. Cause I think I've got I think I've got a few bowmen who could actually do some work. Okay, um, I think my man just mopped the fucking floor with him. I actually got gifted Unreal World, but, uh, maybe in time. <laughs> yeah, my man is doing very well, I think. My man is certainly doing fucking great. Since, uh... Wait, let's put this to desktop. I think Unreal World was free, but um, the guy who's doing it obviously needs to sustain himself in a way. Also, look at how many fucking hours I've played on Endless Base 2. Don't worry, it's gonna be a very, very uh, complete review. Fuck so, Fawns. <laughs> yeah, I think I've got Tome here, actually, Tales of Magiile. Or I've got it pirated. The only shit I'm never actually going to be playing on stream is this. Since you asked whether I heard about X Anima, Oh man, I have a new license agreement, yeah boy. Wait, where's my arena? Where's my arena? I think I made a. I think I made a bunch of um, different ones. Oh no, we can't show that on stream. Wait, where's the? I need. I need a. I need a facial cast. Let me. Uh, I need a. I need a reference picture to work from. Give me a sec. Um. Give me a fucking second. Sorry, my meme, my meme folder is is very oversaturated. Give me a sec. I need uh, I can see this on the other screen so I can work from it. All right. Can I zoom? Yeah. I think I think that would be fine. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I 
Oh no, there's no space. Fucking Tyler too. Wait, what is his skin tone? I think... Yeah. I think that's about right. Wait, voice pitch. Is that the Chinese voice? Yep, amazing. Yeah, let's do this shit. I think uh, my boy Tyler would not fuck around with anything else. Now nah, we going for Mace, boys. We go in Mace and we go in Little Sword. Let's do it. Uh, but of course, you don't want to be cat caught like not wearing shoes. Let's go. Oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Come here. <laughs> the tactical dance of a Tyler. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ty you don't want to activate Tyler. Don't do it, I've got the lower ground. Don't do it, I've got the lower ground. <laughs> uh, yes, please, please, yes. I want a club for my club. A penny for my faults, good sir. Yes. I saw one guy, guys um, playing this shit as well. Oh wait, is, are those better shoes? Yeah, those are better shoes. Am I allowed to strip people on stream? Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, let's just do it. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I can't wait for the, the Tyler 1 Ninja Cage match. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Easy shit. Easy shit. No. Not the head. Oh. You fool. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna do like the back, the back fighting tactic. This is the one where you just like face- oh. <laughs> Wait, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. I'll, I'll try my best. Ugh. Oh, I see you're trying to approach me. Fuck. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Very sorry. My chip, my, my, uh, I'm sorry. I completely forgot if Tyler1 shows up on your screen. Um, can I please... Uh, is that better? Is that any better? Um... Wait, I can chroma key this. I never knew. <laughs> Don't worry, I chroma keyed it. <laughs> it's wait, how does it look like now? Oh. Now I mean that's in, that's interesting, honestly. Wait, wait. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, wait. Where is that shit? Oh, I have Diablo font. I'm so happy I've got Diablo font. Let's see here. Yeah, let me transform, fit the screen. Transform. Oh no 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 no! Sorry, this is terrible. I'm very I'm very sorry. Um, fit to screen. Uh, uh. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, this is this is perfect. 
Yeah, this is perfect. <laughs> Can I please move that shit a little bit lower? <laughs> Please reset that transform. <laughs> there are server folders for the Discord. Ooh. Wait, wait. Let me let me do one more fight as Tyler. Uh, I just fought a uh, Mandalore covered Arx Fatalis very well, so that's why I just haven't touched it. A any, any game that um, Mandalore covers very very well, I'm just not gonna touch it. Uh, that, that was a thing for um, I, Divine Cybermancy. Like, it, it, it is a fantastic game, absolutely. But that man played that game way too much. This man going to spin. <laughs> this is truly how you dab a Nene. It's a shame you can't, um, I don't think I have many options for uh, rotating my view, unfortunately. All, the, all these guys with, like, their very long weapons, you just fucking, uh, you just fucking go right up to them. My, my, my small limbs are an advantage here. His 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 advantage uh, a pointy stick, uh, my my advantage um, a head that cannot be cracked. <sighs> if somebody's asking about joining the Merchants Guild, just uh, stay off the of fucking Discord. Like that's this is like the first thing I fucking tell people. We, we we need a place to actually contain people, so. Oh, thank you. Yay, I just wanted the camera to get actually closer. How simple. How simple. <laughs> oh, the Discord is, is, is wonderful. It's just like not something I'm going to be actively recommending. Oh, boy. I, I, I love the Discord, but it's like, there there are the forces of evil who are not uh, going to be very happy if I endorse the Discord. <laughs> Can I just show you how the Discord is? Um, somebody asked for a Belarus Discord. I think we've got like a new Belarus Discord. Yeah. I think a lot of people have actually embraced the Belarus Discord. We're fr we're flying the national Belarus colors, and we're uh, doing doing good by our boy Lukashenko. Did I did I ever tell you what like the Belarusian president thinks about COVID nineteen, uh, which is really um, great? Uh, the translation from Russian was practically, um, "What virus? Do you see virus? I don't. Just um, go do ice hockey." Uh, go to the sauna, and uh, he was once speaking, speaking at a press conference, which was really, really funny, and he was saying, like, um, you know, I've heard from sources, as if these are, like, actually reputable sources, 50 to 70 ml of vodka daily might be curative. Yeah, I fucking love Lukashenko. He's, he's, he's the best Belarusian boy. Um, I didn't know, actually, how long he's been president for. I think he's about 20 years now. Uh, oh man, we can't actually show this. Uh, this this Discord is, um, you know, everybody's having fun, and uh, at the same time, we're having to deal with Discord terms of service. Oh, can I tell? I can tell another fun um, story. Um, honest, honestly. Um, I won't give the specifics, and I won't tell uh, who it was, 
But I think it, we, we, we had a couple of interesting run-ins in this Discord. Uh, this might have been actually the previous one, because it was last year. Yeah, we, we had the, the Fed in, in, our, in our Discord. <laughs> uh, not, not the American Fed, because that would be a little bit um, too much. But we had the uh, Australian we we had the Australian intelligence come into our uh, Discord. It was uh it was really fun. Um, it, it was it was something. They, they didn't care about the content of of anything that was in there. It's just that Australian intelligence just wanted to um, verify and audit because um, some some merchants who shall not be named are also part of uh, the Australian intelligence. And, uh, yeah, they don't give a shit what he posts or, or she posts, but, uh, they, they, they just want them not to, uh, get lippy or talk about secrets and anything like that. So that was, that's the story. It was pretty fun. <laughs> Literally had no other run-ins. So it was great. <laughs> no, we weren't planning to, uh, Mossad anybody. <laughs> Okay, what 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 else we got here, boys? Let's see. I'm going to uh very very quickly uh grab an extra coffee and then we can do Fahrenheit. Um I actually cut off a stream last time on Fahrenheit uh for a very specific reason because the next shit that we have to do is very painful. It's going to be very it's going to be very fun for you to watch cuz uh, Fahrenheit is a great game to just watch and not actually play. Um, but to go through these segments, yeah, it's not that fucking great. I shall, uh, BRB. Give me one, give me one Sekiru. <laughs> what do you mean the Australians are working for the Chinese? <laughs> the Australians are working for the Americans who are all working for the Chinese. <laughs> what the hell do I have in these goddamn things? Yeah, I'm going to put on some fucking wholesome documentary. Uh, don't kill each other for three minutes. I'll be RB. Jos paard woont op drie hoog en als de televisie kijkt, <laughs> kijken er drie wilde dieren mee. Tot zijn verbijstering is de grootste el van Europa gaan nestelen in de plantenbak voor zijn raam. De oehoe. Een bijzondere el die zich normaal bijna niet laat filmen. En dit alles tot grote vreugde van Jos... Want in de plantenbak scharrelen nu ook drie reuze kuikens. Kijk. Ik moet kan eens kijken, zitten ze er nou nog wel? Oh ja, ze zitten nog. Ja, 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 ze zitten nog. In eerste instantie was Jos bang voor duiven in zijn plantenbak. Hij begon dan uh, om een uur of negen. Half negen. Mm. Mm. En ik dacht, verdomme, weer die duiven, nee. En ja, dat zijn mijn vrienden. <laughs> vrienden niet. En dan heb ik een keer, was ik ook iets eerder thuis, ik dacht, nou ga ik eens kijken wat er nou zit. En uh, dan vloog zij weg. Dat was heel de week al die uil die zat te roepen. Dat is uh, voor mij ook 24 uur film. Hè? Ja, als je zo uh, s morgens wakker wordt en uh, ze zitten zo weer al voor het raam. Dat is geweldig, hè? Gaat u wel eens tegen ze? Ja hoor. <laughs> Wat zegt u dan? Huh? Wat zegt u dan? Hé, hey, jongens. Hé, hey. ja. Ja, wat zou het een tamme hoe kunnen zijn? Dat kan ik niet zeggen. Het zou kunnen, hè? Ja, kijk, dat is zo uh, lekker makkelijk zo. Hè? En dan, uh, dan zit meestal moeder daar. En dan probeer ik op deze stoel te gaan zitten om haar dan ook uh, even. Ja. Toch even kijken hoe dat ze zou reageren. Hè? Ik ben het meeste type, kijk, ik heb daar een kussen. En dan. <lacht> en jongens, ja. Kijk, maar je ziet, ze zijn net zo relaxed. Ze hebben geen schrik. 
En dan voorstellen de, dan hier nog twee maanden zitten. Hè. Dus dan heb je zulke vogels hier. Ze reageren dus ook als je naar de tv kijkt. Dan had hij zo mooi recht, daar zitten ze daar. Of met z'n tweeën of weer alleen. Of met z'n drieën, heb ik ook al gehad. En dan ja, zien ze die schitteringen. Hè. Nee, ze zullen er op, op één dag niet meer zijn. Hè? Dan heeft u een empty nest. Ja, dan heb ik een empty nest. Ja, inderdaad. Ja. En dan in de hoop dat ze volgend jaar nog een keer weer komen. Hè. Ja. Dat ziet u wel zitten. Ja, ja, ja. Dan mag er hierin zitten, mag er daarin zitten. Ja, laat ze maar komen. Als het maar geen duiven zijn. <laughs> Daar heb ik minder mee. Ja. Het is heel bijzonder. Ja, dit maakt eigenlijk niemand mee. Where is he? Where could he be? Maybe him typing in 30 seconds meant that I'm coming. Dad, 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 dad's back. Dad's back from his shop. He got his vanilla Coke. He wants to get back with mom. He wants to make for one functional relationship work here. <laughs> oh yeah. Um, let me, let me, let me pop on Fahrenheit. Got to follow my boy, Tyler. Oh, yeah. Um, wait, while this pops on. Yeah, I, t I took a halfy. I took a fucking halfy. Also, also um, don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, your man, Seth, is, is going to be dealing with his health. Don't worry about that. Endless Space 2 soundtrack is, is, is absolutely bopping. Unfortunately, I listen to that so goddamn often that it, it, it does eventually uh, get tiring. I have to put on some other stuff. <laughs> All right. Somebody asking about Corona. I already had the Corona. One of, one of my mans is having corona for a second time, he believes. Oh, um, I, I want to tell you like one, one little really uh, quick story. Like if anybody's interested in, uh, in business. By the way, by the way, can I, can I just like uh, show you like um, the DLive platform? I, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you first, who are we competing with on the DLive platform? Um, because you, you, you see that like it's still an emerging platform. Um, people, people don't really get as many viewers here than, than Twitch, but you know, the first fucking thing I see, uh, when I pop on D live is, um, big sexy 84. I need help paying my rent. Got an, got an eviction notice. Please help. So, this, so don't worry. We're, we're doing all right, uh, for competing on the D live platform. Now, if you want 
big reasons of why a lot of boys aren't coming on DLive. Oh, yo. Um, <laughs> shout out to Biz. If you want a big reason why people aren't actually coming on DLive, like I was thinking about this because um, I, I, I talk to people and I try to solicit them and say, yo, you know, um, they're, 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 they're giving people cash. Uh, if you get the Twitch partnership, the Twitch partnership is a contract that lasts into continuity. And it actually says that you've got an exclusivity uh, dealt uh, into the contract. So even if you uh, said, okay, there's some greener pastures here, I could, I could do pretty well, uh, that would immediately void your Twitch partnership. And if people worked really hard for that, uh, they're not going to let go of that. And they are under no obligation to give you back your Twitch partnership as a lesson. So Twitch got that fucking monopoly. Uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, oh, can I show you like another thing? Because um, one, of, one, of, one of the merchants, uh, one, of, one of the Finnish merchants, he, uh, he got me a hold of uh, Might and Magic 6, 7, and 8. Uh, which gets merged together into one game. So I'm probably going to, at some point, redo the Might and Magic 6 review because it sucked ass. Uh, but there is another reason I wanted to do it. Let me show you my assets folder. My assets folder, which is entirely filled with uh, shit like this, which I may find a use for at some point. Wait, could this actually work as an image? What the fuck? Let me check my uh, my fucking assets folder. Oh no, I need to unchrome a key this, please. I need to remove that, remove a chroma key. Wow, that actually works. Now nah, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just amazed that this would actually work. <laughs> Most people who watch your videos watch literally every. <laughs> yeah, thank you, man. Uh, I try, I try and make that stuff uh, rewatchable, but there was a reason. Why I wanted to do uh, my Magic 6 re-review. Uh, the composer of the Might and Magic soundtracks, especially for Heroes of Might and Magic, is a lovely Italian man called uh, Paul Anthony Romero. And uh, one of the merchants asked Paul Anthony Romero uh, to do a little bit. So I'll, I'll show you what he did. But this man didn't do just one bit, which would have been like to satisfy her request. He was so nice. He did like what seven recordings because he just wasn't sure let me check if this works hey hey people it's paul anthony romero here <laughs> he's such a little fucking sweetheart honestly he fucking recorded that shit like seven times over. <laughs> hey people, it's Paul Anthony Romero here. <laughs> L literally be a, a bald, bald Ital Italian American and uh, have a great time. Um, still, still got to get his um, his album sent over, but it was a uh, it was really sweet. <laughs> On honestly, uh, honestly, a blessing. Meanwhile, we back to Lucas Kane. Okay, let's see how far we got. Thank you for the diamond, brother. Now. We are going to spend some fun times with Tyler. Come in. H hello, detective. Hello, Mrs. Morrison. Uh, thanks for taking the trouble to come down. Uh, please, take a seat. By the way, I got my subtitles back into English. Now, uh we're going to try and assemble a composite photo of the suspect you saw. We have a computer program to help us. You'll see, it's really simple. It's kind of like a video game. Have you ever played a video game, Mrs. Morrison? 
<laughs> no. Ah, <laughs> uh, it doesn't matter. You're gonna do fine. Typical Karen. The most important thing is to try to remember exactly what happened. The program consists of several types of facial features. You scroll through them until it looks like the man you saw. You understand? Yes. Well, I think I do. Okay. Let's go. Fucking Karens. Yeah. This this looks like Lucas Kane, honestly. <laughs> My man Lucas Kane. He had these Asiatic features. He had these shifty eyes. <laughs> he had a he had a receding hairline. He was clearly an Italian. <laughs> My man Lucas Kane. <laughs> Wait, let me get rid of that fucking mustache. I'm actually gonna check. I think I think this is the most accurate, honestly. I just gotta get rid of his shifty ass eyes. Hontani Watashiwa Watashiwa Lucas Kane. <laughs> this is like uh, reality, and this is fucking fantasy. Ohayo, deska. <laughs> the name is Lucas King. <laughs> I didn't kill him. Did Lu did Lucas have like a strong chin? That's what I forget. Wait. Honestly, I think those eyes are pretty good. I was. I Cause I when I when I was playing this game back in the day, wait wait let me let me put the Mike Miller mustache. <laughs> back when I played this game, uh, I was thinking that like uh, I had to make the trail a little bit colder uh, for my man Lucas Kane, just so he can actually get out of there. But uh, apparently, it, it 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 won't really matter too much. Now, is this the face of the person you saw? Uh, come on, speak, Karen. Yes, at least th that's how I remember him. Thank Wait, you what? Thank so much for your help. We're going to get this picture out to all the airports, trains, and bus stations, and to all of our patrolmen. If Are you fucking kidding me? York, we're going to find him. And go buy yourself a video game. <laughs> I can't fucking believe this shit. That was him. My man Lucas Kane throwing up in the toilet. Typical. I guess I'll never find out. Uh, by the way, I'll try and do more fail states in Fahrenheit because that shit is actually funny. I was burning with fever. I was shaking all over. The migraine was back and drilling holes into my brain. And to top it off, I couldn't keep any food down. My body seemed to be fighting against something, but I still didn't know what. Wait, we can change into standard definition? What the fuck is this? Yeah. My man Lucas Kane looking nice. Lucas, check if there's any kind of treats in the toilet. <laughs> my man, my man, uh... My man didn't even wash his hands. Wait, I'm gonna check. Think, think I'm just gonna go into insanity if I don't wash my hands. Can't wait till he has, has a breakdown in the toilet again. Um. Um. Can, can I tell you something? That's not meant to happen. This is really not meant to happen. Uh, re remastered edition my ass, David Cage. I guess I'll never find out why I was an Im immaterial being of light at that point. I don't think I was meant to get to that part, honestly. Lucas, please stop no clipping. Wait, what the hell? There was actually uh, something else I could do here. I think the dryer works. It's not a ga David Cage game until you can do all of this.
<laughs> this is Lucas. This is Lucas just wasting company time. <laughs> this is Lucas just like imagining caressing titties. He does have a job. He's a system engineer. Okay. Let's just check what's in the other stalls. Come on, Lucas. Gotta just live my life no matter what. Don't raise any suspicions. Despite the state I was in, I decided to go to work as though nothing had happened. Yeah, this is the typical words of, like, somebody who's sane. <laughs> Come on, Lucas. <laughs> I, I forgot what happens if you get close to somebody else here, honestly. Wait, let's, let's, let's go run into my employees. Is that the cell I have to get to? Just one sec. Hi, Lucas. How's tricks? This is a man. This is a man with low polys. All oh, right, right, right. I'm in charge of computer maintenance in the Naser and Jones Bank. I share my office with Warren. Fuck that guy. <laughs> Lucas immediately gets uncomfortable. I'm just gonna check if I can actually uh, make him have more breakdowns. Oh, yeah. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just having a normal day. Wait, wait, wait. Let, 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 I just want to check if I can actually do anything in these other cubicles, because I didn't actually have the opportunity to do that. By the way, by the way, we, uh, we got a great sequence coming up. You're going to fucking love it. My man Luke is going to have his fucking breakdown soon. I walked in the office with Wart. I felt uncomfortable. Maybe that was my privilege. My middle class privilege. Do you know what time it is? What's wrong with you? I had a little problem on the way back in. I had to go back home and change my clothes. He suspects nothing. He's not even typing anything in the keyboard. I guess I'll never know what Warren was programming that day, or why he looked at me so uncomfortably kept padding the same keys on the keyboard. I wasn't fooled, Warren. I knew. <laughs> Sorry. Listen here, Warren. If there weren't quotas to fill here... Wait, let's see what happens. Snowing again. And the weather forecast predicts another drop in temperature over the next few days. Warren, hand me that keyboard. I'll show you how it's done. Are you feeling uncomfortable? What if I approach you from the right side instead? <laughs> Your man looking so uncomfortable here. Don't mind me, Warren. I'm just trying to get my cardiovascular. Gets the blood flowing in such situations. <laughs> Sorry. I gotta do this for all of these. Oh no! <laughs> that guy is so bizarre. He gives me the creeps. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> what? You were saying something? 
No, I, hope, I didn't say anything. I hope this white guy sure doesn't fucking right, kill me. I... I heard something as though I could read his mind. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't look at pictures of your girlfriend. Well, we, we leave her messages unread. Ah, a crucifix. Fantastic. I needed... I needed Jesus now more than ever. The shelf would not go in. Oh, my man. Lucas? <laughs> you okay? This is the shit Ward has to put yeah, up with every yeah, day. I'm fine. May not look like much, but yo man having a psychotic episode. Lucas Kane. Hello, Lucas. Oh, hello, Tiffany. God I damn it. I a message on your machine last night. Um, I'd like to come and pick up some stuff at your place. Could I come over tonight? Yes. I should be back home around 8 o'clock tonight. Okay, it won't take too long. Are you doing okay, Lucas? I gotta let you go. I'm doing a thing here. Bye. <laughs> I'm busy having a psychotic episode, Tiffany. Goodbye. Oh no! Look out, the cop! Lucas? <laughs> is there a problem? No, I, I, I just thought... It seemed so real. I saw, I saw that, that cop fall. <gasps> My man Warren is so fucking tense. <laughs> Hello? Yes, sir. We'll get on that right away. There was nobody on the upper Station line. He just wanted to get out. Down. I'll go. No, forget it. I'll, I'll handle it. Whatever you say. <laughs> no, Warren. You don't get to leave. <laughs> it happened. Just like I'd seen it. Like the cop in the apartment. Is it possible that I can really see things before they happen? Maybe I can use this for online gambling. I guess I'll get that station. Warren, you want to get that off your shirt? You okay with this spilled coffee here? Hope you don't feel uncomfortable. Oh, my man's gonna have a fucking breakdown. I can't believe this. This is... Um, can, can I be honest? Can I be honest? Uh, this game, I, I I said, like, we're playing on easy. We're playing on easy. I finished this game on easy. I almost got, like, carpal tunnel at the end of it. So, um... Oh, my man! My man having a fucking breakdown! Wait, wait, wait. Oh, my man can't even have a coffee to relax before this shit pops off. Uh. <laughs> yeah, let me just repair this. I'm gonna try fail these fucking problems, don't worry. I'm going to see what happens if I fuck up. <laughs> I'm going to try to do these as bad as possible. Wait, it gave me a great! No, 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 you're not meant to fail. You're not meant to fail. You're going to be losing lives. Wait, was that a great? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, I have 
to finish these. No! Ah! I'm gonna try to give you every like uh, bad scene that goes with the bugs. <laughs> My man getting muay tied by fucking bugs. <laughs> Just get bitch slapped by fucking bugs. Lucas, Lucas, can you hear me? Ah! My God, he's trying to swallow his tongue. Ah! Quick, call an ambulance. And that's how my story ends. I was committed to a mental hospital where I think I finally went insane. I was harassed by nightmarish visions that attacked me non-stop, night and day. I don't know how long I'll be able to resist. But the worst part is, I never did find out what really happened on that cold January night in the diner. Because to the rest of the world, I'm just another insane murderer. <laughs> My man Luke is gonna be fine, okay. Okay, do your best. Do your best, Lucas. I'm gonna try to do this 100%. I, I can't actually see anything you're writing because I have to be in complete focus. Man, David Cage. Get the fuck off me! All these manifestations of war. This bug might know Muay Thai, but uh... Lucas has been training his depression. This is, this is what it feels like posting like a reasonable comment on twitter.com. I imagine the people who are actually seeing this in real fucking life. Lucas is literally hosing people down. Damn, Lucas! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my fucking god. Faces of the same serpent. One in our world, the other in the other world. Woe to he who sees both sides of the snake. No! No! Lucas? Lucas, what happened? Ah! Can you hear me? Are you alright? Lucas, are you okay? Hey, you've hurt yourself. You're bleeding. I, uh, I gotta go. I didn't have the slightest idea what had happened. <laughs> the one thing I do know... I was still employed. Those things almost killed me. Lucas, I hope you're not being racist and just thinking that I'm a bug. You know, not everything is a bug. <laughs> oh 
Carla just looking smug. Okay, we're going to get started. Uh, if you prefer, you can wait outside. I'd rather stay here if you don't mind. I've studied some medicine. I've seen dead bodies. Oh. As you wish. No apparent hematoma on the body. Two broken fingernails on the right hand. These are intuition checks. He didn't see the murderer until the last moment. He didn't have time to struggle. Large hematoma on the back of the cranium. Oh my um, god, Cage. Fracture of the occipital bone. He cracked his head when he fell. Abnormal dilation in, um, both pupils. I'm gonna see what happens if I fuck up. Oh my Why god. His pupils dilated. What did he see before he died? I'm gonna try and fuck up the next prompt. Three knife wounds between the third and fifth ribs in the proximity of the heart. Uh, the blade was driven in deeply. Uh, the stabs seem to have been delivered from the front and moved That's from an English left accent. to right. One stab. Oh, I just couldn't think. The aorta, and the other two cut the left and right coronary arteries. Oh, he really didn't have a chance. The blade slipped right through the ribs to cut the arteries. It was definitely the knife wounds that caused his death? Yes. Yeah, the three arteries leading to the heart were cut. Uh, the heart was literally uh, disconnected from the rest of the body. Do you think the killer had some knowledge of anatomy? It's not impossible, but I doubt that someone who understood human anatomy would do this. You'd really have to be deranged to want to provoke a slow and agonizing death in this manner. I uh, saw a case like this once before. It was a while back now, in the 90s, I think. Exactly the same. Three stabs around the heart, each one cutting a main artery. It really struck me at the time. I wondered how such a thing were possible. It was the, um, what was that name again? Karsten or Kirsten, something like that. Kirsten? Yes, that's it, Kirsten. You know about that case? Not yet. But I'm sure as hell gonna find out. Then you're gonna make me have a fucking panic attack. By the way, Carl is claustrophobic. But meanwhile, my man Lucas. I felt empty. After what happened at the office, I began to wonder if I wasn't going nuts. I'm so totally exhausted that I can't fall asleep. I'm afraid of the dreams I might have. I wander around the room a little. I guess I'll go to sleep when I can't keep my eyes open any longer. Right, Lucas, baby. Uh, I don't think this happens now. Yeah, I think it's later. Let me check. Let me check how we... Uh, no, no, no. I need the guide. I need the fucking guide. Mm -mm -mm. God damn it. I remember there was an exact uh, walkthrough. Yeah, game facts, baby. <clears throat> oh, fucking hell. How do we fuck Tiffany? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Um, uh... Tiffany, duh, 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 duh. yes, 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 I got it, I got it, let's do it, yeah, got it, let's do the Lucas Kane womanizer routine. A man dove directly into the frozen water at Central Park today to save a child who had tumbled in by accident. 
The young boy was successfully resuscitated and will completely recover. His courageous rescuer disappeared before the ambulance had even arrived, apparently a case of a reluctant hero. The investigation continues into the... No, 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 turn it off, turn it off. Yep, 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 Lucas, I hope... He didn't even get any positive motivation from that shit. Come on, Lucas. Put some bopper beats on the only licensed tracks we have here. Come on, Lucas. How, how do I get out of this? <laughs> it's time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Fury of a Dead Man, but they do sometimes sound like Nickelback. Nothing I like here. Only noodles. Finally, some sanity. You have no new messages. Fuck, fuck. Let's shower up, Lucas. You can have a mental breakdown here. No, we're not gonna look at the mirror. <laughs> oh, my man Lucas fucked up on zipping. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Lucas, have your breakdown. <laughs> Still looking good. Psychotic as fuck. I would change of a Trex Carpenter Brute. Fuck is Tiffany. My man Lucas needs to... My man Lucas needs to smash. Make these... Make this a little bit warmer. Make this uh, man pit a little bit better for Tiffany. I just realized what the fuck is this goddamn wallpaper. Let's check that bit in box. Nah. 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 Literally nothing. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Sorry. I'm very sorry. Come on, Lucas. Get the fuck out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Is that medicine? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't know if he can have alcohol now. Oh, my lord. Thus spoke Zarathustra by Nietzsche. I've read it so many times, I know half of it by heart. No elaboration. Nothing. Wait, is Tiffany gonna show up? Where the fuck is she? Fuck on. Gotta probe this.
Oh well. Whatever, Lucas. Get into your nasty ass bed. <laughs> Jesus. Fucking Christ, Lucas. <laughs> it is time. <laughs> I sleep, I wake, I eat the milk. I came to pick up my stuff. I hope I'm not disturbing you. No, I'm just a little bit sleepy. Come in. <clears throat> Have a seat. <laughs> Have a seat in my dusty ass apartment. I'll go and get your stuff. It's just two boxes. No! I'm not sure exactly where they'd be now, but they shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, they've got my initials on them. Lucas. Lucas. Lucas, you're fucking blue balling me. Yes. <laughs> it's time. This time. <laughs> Lucas! <laughs> Lucas fucking hell! Hi. Hey. Hi. I came to pick up my stuff. I hope I'm not disturbing you. No, I'm just a little bit sleepy. Come in. <laughs> my man! <laughs> Tiffany is like, so sympathetic for the situation. Have a seat. Have a seat. Don't move. Don't move too much. Lucas, that's how you that's how you talk to people. So, how's life? I'm pretty swamped with work at the hospital right now, and I'm not completely moved in yet, but I'm doing fine. Want something to drink? I think there's still a bottle of gin laying around in the kitchen somewhere if you want. Yeah, I'd love some. Yep, typical nurse. She fucking loves her alcohol. Where's the gin? Where's the alcohol? Don't drink it, Lucas. <laughs> oh man, these fucking hand mechanics. What the fuck? He actually puts like his fingers out in intervals. Thanks. I'll go and get your stuff. It's just two boxes. I'm not sure exactly where they'd be now, but they shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, they've got my initials on them. Okay, wait, we'll give her a drink. Sincere sentimental. Oh, yes. 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 Let's go, let's go, let's go. Where the fuck are your boxes, Tiffany? I don't give a fuck. Why do I keep airing my apartment? Goodbye, Tiffany. 
I'm going to become the Amazon delivery man you've always wanted. There'll be no package missed ever again. Sorry, I was just checking if I could actually use that thing. Oh wait, there's more? I swear to God, Tiffany. <laughs> you want this? You want this? Am I getting closer to the poon? <laughs> I hope you're not frustrated, Tiffany. I hope you're not feeling... <laughs> oh, whoops. Clumsy. Here they are. I think that's everything. Is everything okay, Lucas? You look stressed. I... I've got some big problems right now. I can't really talk about it, but it's fairly serious stuff. If there's anything that I can do for you, Lucas... Man, I wish there was, but no. Thanks for offering, though. Hey, I, I miss you, you know? I miss you, too. Are you... are you with anybody? I'm sorry, I shouldn't be asking you that. No, no, it's okay. Yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy. No, I'm still alone. And you? Yeah, I'm alone, too. I've had a little trouble getting over you. You no. still playing? You know, I really haven't even thought about it lately. Play a couple of notes for me, will ya? You know, in memory of the good times. If you fuck okay, this sure. up, you don't get puss. Let's do it, boys. do <clears throat> I will try my best not to fuck up don't worry <laughs> color sequences this is how you get the women. <laughs> Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. How'd you like that? How'd you like Nickelback? Well, I'm gonna go. <laughs> this is how you approach a Oh my god, I gotta I gotta cut this stream really soon. Still wearing the same shirt.
I, I need censoring for this. I need censoring for this. This is like outside the terms of my contract. Please, please help us. I can only I can only tell you what's going on. It, it's actually full on nudity. Wait, wait, what if I fuck it up? Wait, I fucked it up. I think my man Lucas is about to get fucking attacked. And then he went back to a peaceful slumber. Wait, I never knew that was an option! <laughs> okay, okay, we do this sequence, and then I, I, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta dip. But, uh, I never knew you could do that! <laughs> I had some shit on my mind this morning. I knew Samantha was depressed, but I didn't know what I could really do about it. I was happy to be back in here. Man, I love that smell of old leather and sweat. Maybe I could just forget about everything for an hour and just get in a good workout with Carla. Damn, you look a little out of it, Carla. You sure you're cool? I'm fine. Why wouldn't I be? Okay. Let's warm up a little then go for it. Let me know when you're ready. Okay. Sounds good. My man Tyler's gonna fucking kill Carla. Let's go. I swear to fucking God. Yo, I need to do my whole warm-up routine in order to get really ready. <laughs> One. Two. I can't fucking believe this shit. Three. Four. Five. Muscolo. Yeah, baby. Muscolo. Eight. You see, you hear that shit in the background? And that's me working my hardest. Nine. My man gonna crush his neck. Damn. Yeah. I'm in pretty good shape this morning. One more set and I'll be ready to get in the ring. What? The, okay, Tyler, please. What else can my man Tyler do? This fucking machine. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I ain't what? failing this shit. I don't want to do this shit again. <laughs> I had to. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Fucking hell, man! The stream brought to you by Aunt Jemima. Tyler. Cool. I'm ready to rock. Fuck out of here. Fuck you doing. Weak ass flexes. Let me know when you're ready. 
Okay. Wait, I think she needs a sanity card. Oh. Oh, she gets the water. I understand. Has hasn't done anything. Needs the water. <laughs> don't be tempted for more. You're a desert animal. You don't need it. Can't believe this. I forgot if her machines are actually different. <laughs> she just leaves the gym. What? Are you kidding me? Oh my fucking god! How is this in any way equivalent? How is this in any way equivalent? You, you don't have rep, rep- You don't have fucking reps in- One last set and I'll be ready to fight. What? Okay, I, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, that, that was a burn. Uh, when I was doing Tyler, that, that was hard. I, is that a yoga mat? <laughs> you can do it, Carla. <laughs> yeah, I, I could actually probably convince Carla to, to be doing squats instead. I, 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 I swear to God. One, two, three. Four, oh my god, it's just five, Carla being a fish six, and climbing up ropes. Seven, yeah, that's equivalent. Eight, nine, <laughs> ten. Okay, I'm warmed up. I'm ready to get in the ring. My man Tyler's gonna kick her ass. Kill her, Tyler. Just destroy. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Las Vegas for tonight's match between... Terrible Tyler Miles and Killer Carla Valenti. Killer. Oh yeah, and who's always kicking out the crap about me acting like a kid all the time? Oh no, I went into the fight as her. Oh man, that's fucked. I want to do it as Tyler. I swear to God. I think your yoga's gonna save you? Today, Carla fucking dies. Wait, I'm gonna make her succeed one. Okay, now you saw it on stream, a white woman punched a black man. Back to the kitchen with your honk, with your honky ass. Yeah, you're pretty good, but I schooled you, bitch. What the you fuck? Did yourself. So oh. you, you want to go again? Yes. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> oh. 
Wait, I'm just gonna look for one heavy knockdown and then I think that's it. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. And yeah, we went, we went over the time. Um... Wait, what the fuck? Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Ah, uh, okay, cuz, um... I'll probably save it for, uh, for next time. We'll save a basketball match for next time. Anything, I think, anyway, I think, um... I think canonically... This is what Carl the fucking looks like after that whole match. <laughs> uh, yeah, boys, uh, we, we done. Um, I'm going to dip out. Hopefully we'll looks have like some education. Match. We'll probably have some education next time for the final one. We'll do a basketball match with Tyler. Should be good shit. It's a Saturday, same, same time. Uh, you boys, uh, have a good one. Stay safe, stay cool. And uh, I'll catch you around next time. Uh, I'm really happy that I went for Carla. <laughs> anyway, God bless. Take care.